today. Merch is out now. Very exciting. I will have the link in the description below for you guys to shop. Thank you. Yay. Good morning, guys. Welcome to potentially a weekend in my life vlog. Hi, guys. It is so backlit right now, but welcome to another vlog. I'm currently walking to meet Kit to go work out this morning. I'm going to her Pilates place that she loves, which is exciting. I have the weekend off. So I'm just hanging out with friends and I'm very, very excited. If you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe. Um, I'll have merch linked down below that came out yesterday, so. Guys, this is my wild Saturday night in New York. I was so exhausted. I'm staying home or in my hotel have the fireplace on, I just DoorDash Eataly, and that's the plan tonight. I feel really lame, and I kept going back and forth on if I'm gonna regret staying in, but I come to New York often enough. But I am just absolutely so exhausted that me going out tonight and stuff, when I plan tomorrow at 9 a.m., just, there's just no chance. I just need to stay in. I've had a really good day by myself, which is really what I needed. Especially after recording that many episodes, it's just a lot. Anyways, um, I'll talk to you guys tomorrow, but it's a very chill, little weekend in New York also. It's just really nice kind of being in a hotel by yourself for a while. Today's just been really like chill and cozy, so. Sunday guys, um, welcome back to the vlog. Sorry I didn't really vlog much yesterday, like I said. Honestly, it was a good learning experience for me. If you listened to my podcast episode that was last week or the week before with Paul Fishman, we talked a lot about like self-love and versus self-care and things like that. We also talked about like shooting yourself, which I know Lauren Elizabeth talks about too. Um, he's like a self-love coach though. So I was just so exhausted and I'm also like way more introverted than I realized growing up. Danielle and Brooke and I talk about this in the podcast because we all feel that way. I think because I'm really outgoing and I can be loud, I always thought I was an extrovert. Anyways, with that being said, I just felt really guilty that I was in New York and all I wanted to do was just like take the afternoon and night to just lay in bed in my hotel room, order room service, watch movies, just like really chill and relax. And I felt really guilty obviously because I'm in like New York. But one, obviously I'm paying for all of this. And two, I do come to New York like really frequently, especially like now I'll be coming here all the time. And like I've always wanted a day where I'm just in a hotel like ordering room service and watching movies and stuff. I actually watched um, He's All That with Addison Rae. I thought it was really cute. I just like need to know who did the wardrobe in that movie. Also, practically speaking, I need to know how much money they made off brand endorsements and that because I swear to God, within the first five minutes, I had spotted like 17. Anyways, um, it's like one of those cute, cheesy movies, you know? And then I was thinking like, I don't want to like hate myself for being lame when I could see my friends that I'm not with all the time, even though I'm gonna see a lot of them in like three weeks. But I just knew like I was so wiped that I needed to just stay in. I also think it is equally as important to be able to like spend time by yourself and actually love traveling alone for that reason. And my Bare Minerals Complexion Rescue, Keaton posted about this and I bought it. Speaking of, it's Keaton's birthday right now. Happy birthday, Keaton. This is like the one thing I apply with my hands. Like, is that bad? I was just shooting myself and making myself feel really guilty when I was just listening to my body. That's what I was doing. You're not late for doing what you feel like you should do. And no one's gonna get mad at you. And Honestly, it was a really good time. I'm really over explaining that. Today, um, it's a pretty chill Sunday. This is a really chill weekend in New York. Um, normally when I'm here, it's just like go, 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 I need to see everybody. But now that I come more often, now that I come like a lot more often too, I don't really feel that way anymore. Some of my friends from college actually, they're actually married to each other, um, are from New York and they just happen to be here for a few weeks right now. So they're actually about to come pick me up and then we're gonna go to breakfast. The only thing I have planned today is I know I'm getting dinner with the Year of Ours team tonight because they're also in New York, so I'm just meeting up with, at least I know it's Eleanor. There's just something about a more relaxed weekend in New York though that I'm really loving. Loving that for me, really learning so much about myself, guys. Don't get me wrong, like if I need to go, go, go and have like a really crazy, packed whatever, I can do it. I mean, I did it this week. I can do that for sure, but like something about a slow weekend in New York where you don't really have that many obligations which is what I wanted, is just incredible, guys. Thank you. All right, guys.
guys, so I just left um, seeing at my friends from college, catching up with my friends, which was great. I feel like my AirPods are falling out at literally all times. I'm shopping in Soho. I think I'm actually gonna go see Danny and Ryan in like an hour or so. I really actually think I might walk over to Bleecker because I really wanna go to the last line and I haven't been to the New York store. So I think that's my plan. I'm also listening to Maddie's book club podcast episode on OK Sis. As I walk and shop, I mean, this is the dream. Guys, I love the daily edit. We're going in. I haven't ever been into a store. I've seen stuff in stores, but this is exciting. Guys, we're finally here. I'm so excited. Like, the stuff is just literally perfect. Their branding is awesome. Just walking through the streets of New York, like this is actually magical. Guys, if I move here for like a short period of time, even just a month, what month should I do it? Preferably, obviously not the holidays, even though that's a beautiful time, but like snow and family, you know? I mean, it really is a dream. So beautiful, I wish I was a multi, multi, multi millionaire and owned one of these, but you know, here we are. Okay, I'm still walking around. This is definitely my favorite area of New York, but I'm gonna go over to Danny's in probably like 20 minutes because Ryan is here and I can finally meet him. I can't believe I haven't met him, but they weren't dating when I visited her at college and then it's been COVID, so haven't met him. It's very exciting. And then we're just gonna chill for a little bit. Um, we're all really tired and don't really wanna do anything. I think I might pick up like a smoothie or a juice or something. I'm listening to country, I'm sitting outside, and I'm drinking my Joe and the Juice. I got the pick-me-up, which I normally get the green tonic, but this one's actually really good. It's easier to drink than the green one if you need like a good juice from here that isn't green and looks gross. Um, this is good. He's very well documented. <laughs> I know, but okay guys, here we are with Danielle and Ryan. I, I think I'm so no, excited. I felt the same way. I asked, okay, like when do you think Picasso died? And it was literally like the 70s or the 80s. It feels like the 15th century. Like, yeah, I just, literally something like about that feels wrong. Like BC, like yeah. 80s, like. <laughs> Ryan like knew the answer, but it's Ryan, fine. 19th century. Yeah. I mean, what sorry. Was that 19th century, 1900s. Okay. Yeah. yeah. See, years for me, I've never been good at that. Like, even It like, just went like, off. Yeah. Well, yeah. yeah, I know with that, but sometimes like, I, I don't even know how to, I just think Picasso, old. Like, that is <laughs> old. Old. That's from so long yeah, ago. Yeah, it's crazy. Wow, go Picasso, so <laughs> As you saw, okay, my Uber is currently five minutes away. I just called a car and I came back here, I changed, I spent the whole day around New York. I'm wearing this from Princess Polly and then just some sneakers, some lip gloss and throw my hair back. Thank God these came back because I genuinely like don't know what I would do. Today was such a good Sunday. I got breakfast as you saw, or like brunch with some friends from college. I'm just gonna, you know, hope for the best with this. No mirror, it's fine. Then I just shopped around um, Soho myself. And then I just walked down Bleecker and like, I am so obsessed with that area. Actually, I think I'm just obsessed with West Village. Then I went and stopped by Danielle's. So anyways, I hung out with Danielle and Ryan and what a guy, I love him. I will say like, I, I will say like my friends are dating like really incredible guys right now. They love Brandon as we know. I've been putting lip gloss on to put mask on. I'm thinking after being with all my friends and my boyfriends this week, like maybe I'll go back to dating. As we know, I was taking a break um, and I keep extending it, but I think like maybe I should do that. Jackie told me that I should be on Hinge. I don't know, I mean, I can tell I'm not serious about it though because if I was ta if I'm talking about it in a vlog, um, I'm not serious about it because I'm like, way more whatever with that stuff. Anyways, I'm going to dinner right now um, with Eleanor from Year of Ours, which is like my favorite athleisure or athletic wear brand. As you guys know, I wear it all the time. I have my mask, here's my outfit, here we are. Um, I think the Year of Ours team is here. I don't know, like they're here for the weekend. I don't know, she just told me to meet her at this restaurant, so we're off. Um, I want a nice little drink and some food. I'm sorry, guys, it's Monday, it is my last blue bottle of the week, which is really sad. 
I just packed all my stuff. I'm importing some footage and everything so I can start editing on my flight. The first vlog of vlog week went up. This is what I'm currently wearing. This crew neck that I think is so cute is from, I think it's Sister and Seekers. It's where the blazer's from. I really, really like their clothes. I made an order a few like weeks ago. Um, I just think it's so cute. Just have some beige sweats on, my Yeezys. My mask. I'm actually listening to Armchair Expert right now. Jess's favorite Formula One racer because she's really getting me into it. I'm gonna watch the Netflix series. We're gonna go to Austin. It's gonna be very exciting. That's in October. So anyways, I'm off. I think I might get the waffle blue bottle. Alright, so they didn't have oat milk this morning. They were all out. So I got the New Orleans with almond milk. Like, I'm not kidding. I've been to Blue Bottle probably a hundred times and I always get New Orleans with oat milk. So that's my normal order. They don't have like waffles or like real food at this location. So I just got a little pound cake. I'll probably have to unfortunately get something at the airport. Having my morning coffee. I'm gonna leave my hotel at 11, so about an hour. It is so humid out right now like i will show you a clip really quick of like that's what my camera was at first normally whenever i leave any sort of trip and i normally don't do trips over like five days and this one was like six nights i'm always ready to go and ready to get back to texas ready i really miss my dogs that's why i really really want to go i am actually like sad to be leaving and i normally it doesn't matter how much i love the city i normally am like really excited to get back and get home and maybe it's the fact that next weekend's Labor Day weekend and we don't have plans and it's gonna be like another underwhelming holiday weekend. It's not even that I don't wanna leave that bad, it's just that I wanna leave here the least, you know? I really do want to do like a month in New York, probably in like a springtime, because I wouldn't wanna do it um, during the holidays, but, um, oh wow. It's actually really good with all the milk. Anyways, I travel here a lot, is what I'm saying, but I am sad to be leaving and maybe that's just because Danielle just moved here. I don't know. Like, it is sad, and I miss my friends. But we're going back to Texas, and I'm gonna be with the dogs today, which I've really, really missed them. So, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog week. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know if you guys like vlog weeks, if you'd rather just have a week in my life vlog. <clears throat> oh my god, I'm losing my voice. I'm actually surprised I didn't lose my voice this week. But, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe. I'll see you soon. Bye. I was thinking about this on the way here. I know that everyone just has to know all the colors. I would never in a million years be able to memorize all those names in different colors. So I actually was thinking that wasn't lychee. I think that's smoke. Oh, no, that is, that is brand lychee. new. Did you just get it? 